on by England. Ericsson, oh, it's spilled by Roebuck and it's 2-2. Hi everyone and uh, welcome back to Honda FC Home Advantage program. This week we'll be learning some uh, fakes and moves and it's a perfect opportunity for you to uh, uh, learn some tricks on how to uh, beat the player and uh, make that shot on goal or maybe create a goal scoring opportunity. Our very own Chelsea women's player Magdalena Eriksson is going to take us through the first three phases of drill one. I will then come back and show you a few more options for you to do for this drill. I hope you like her coaching and teaching points and I hope you get to practice and enjoy. Here is the practice that I have developed in my home environment. And as you can see, you don't need a fancy lawn or anything. You just need a little bit of space and perhaps a defender which could be a mom or, or a dad or a brother or a sister, but in my case, it's a plant and that works perfectly fine. Um, so firstly, I just want to say when learning fakes and moves, what you really want to do is get the defender off balance. So I'm going to show you three different variations uh, of moves where, where all you essentially are doing is trying to get the defender off balance to create some momentum, to drive the ball away from the defender and uh, then shoot, score or cross. Uh, so the first one I'll do is a simple dropping shoulder to then take the ball away to the other side. I'll now demonstrate how it works. So in this drill you're simply just driving towards the defender, dropping a shoulder, making the defender put the weight on the wrong leg and then you're driving away. Okay. One more time. Driving up, dropping a shoulder, and driving away. All right, that's called the dropping a shoulder. And I'll now uh, start with something a little bit more advanced. It's called step over. So then you're simply uh, stepping over the ball, still trying to get the defender off balance, and then you're driving away. So you're simply driving towards the defender, stepping over the ball, and driving away. One more time. You're driving, stepping over, and driving away. There you have the step over, and another version of the step over is the double step over. So in the double step over, you not only step one over once, but you step over twice, and that will really create your momentum to drive away from the defender. All right, you're driving towards the defender, stepping over, stepping over, taking the ball away. Driving towards the defender, stepping over, stepping over, taking the ball away. For this one, I'm going to drive forward with the ball. I'm going to pass the ball across my body with my right foot to trick the defender and move him off balance, and then quickly chop back on my other foot and go the first direction. So it's a quick double touch to take away. One more time, drive at speed across my body, but back the first direction. For this one, I'm going to use the flip flap to go past my defender. For this one, it's important that I get my body in the right position. So I want to have my body positioned on one side of the football. I'm then going to use the outside of my foot to push the ball away, but then quickly use the inside of my foot to bring it back in, off balancing the defender in front of me. So it's there, out to in, to take away. For this one, is slightly more advanced. I'm going to drive forward, and then I'm going to get the sole of my foot and drag the ball across my body. As I do that, I'm going to step with my other foot, use my body to protect against the defender, and take the ball away. So I come out, sole of my foot, step, take the ball with the outside of my foot. One more time. In, roll with the sole of my foot, step, take away with the outside of my left. For this last one, I'm going to attempt a rainbow flick up and over defender's head. So I'm going to drive out slowly. It's important that I get my non-kicking foot up and next to the ball. 
my right foot now is going to bring the ball and sandwich the ball between my feet. As I do this, I'm going to twist my body, flip up and over the defender. So here I go, I drive out, first foot in front, second one over. This is fakes and moves, drill number two. For the setup for this, I'm gonna start down one end. I'm gonna have an obstacle in front of me that I'm gonna try and beat and go one direction. Here's an example of me going to the right. I'm then gonna drive at obstacle number two. Here, for now, I must come inside. So I'm gonna beat my player again, come inside, and then finish into the mini goal. Next time I come out, I will go the other way and the other direction. Here's a very simple one to start with. I'm gonna drive out, drop a shoulder, take with the outside of my boot. Step over, cut inside, finishing the goal. Go in the other direction, same thing, come out, step, take with the outside of my boot. Step over, cut inside, finishing the goal. For this one, we are working on our step overs. So for the first one, I'm gonna step right, take left. For the second one, Step left, take right. Remembering to get nice and low, using my body for disguise. A little bit quicker this time. Step, take, step, take, cut inside, finishing the goal. For this next one, I'm gonna combine two different fakes and moves. So I'm gonna start by coming in, going from one foot to the other to go past the player. For the second one, work on my sole roll to take across, left foot finish. Here it is, a little bit quicker. Double touch for the first one, sole roll for the second, with a left foot finish. Progressing on from my step overs, I'm now gonna add a nutmeg on the defender. So I'm gonna play in, step, go round. As I come in here, step, outside of the boot to go round, quickly, finishing the goal. In a progression to my step overs, I'm now gonna add a nutmeg in on the defender. So I'm gonna play up, step, go round. Drive out, step, step, through the legs, finishing the goal. So I'm out, step left, go right. Double step, outside the boot, finishing the goal. I'm now going to start to challenge myself with one that's a little bit harder. So I'm going to come out and perform a flip flat to go one way. Now I'm going to do a 360 turn, the cut inside, finish in the goal. So I'm out, flip flat, in. 360 turn to bring the inside, finishing in the goal. For this one here, I'm going to attempt the 360 skill to go past two, if not all three, of the obstacles in front of me. So to come out to start, I'm going to go foot on top. I'm then going to step over the ball. I'm going to twist my shoulders and body back the other way, use my other foot to roll the ball forward. All the time while I'm doing this, if this defender in front of me, I'm using my body to protect the ball. So it's there, stepping, Keeping the defender away, using my other foot to roll it forward. Here's a double 360 on two of the different defenders in front of me. So out, 360 on top, 360 to cut inside, finishing the goal. Here I'm going to combine three 360 turns. So out, 360 around to the defender, 360 inside, drag away from the other defender, finishing the goal. Drill three of fakes and moves. For this one, the setup is that I have three objects in a triangle about four to five yards apart. I'm also gonna require two footballs for this drill. The start point is going to be attacking one of the obstacles in front of me, and then I'm gonna to go to the obstacle that is free and not got a football behind it. I then come, beat this football as well, stop the ball and leave it there. I'm then going to take my time to get across to the other ball. Beat the two obstacles in front of me. I'm going to work on just my left foot in this drill. So I'm going to do right foot step overs to take to the left. So I come in, right step, take to the outside of my left. Right step, outside of my left. Leave the ball, take my time to get round. Same again. Right step, outside of left. Right step, outside of left. And for this last one, I'm going to try a double step over, still using the outside of my left to take the ball away. Double step over, I'm going to have to step with my left first. 
Step, step, take away. Step, step, take away. For this next one, I'm going to go the other direction and I'm going to combine two of the moves that I've already worked on. So the first one is going to be a double touch. So one foot onto the other, and then you're going to come at the defender, flip flat, cut back inside, and leave the ball. A little bit sharper this time. Driving up my defender, double touch to beak, flip flat one way, then the other. And the last one round. Drive at the defender, double touch, flip flat to beat my man. For this progression, I'm using two footballs, both at the start point. This is so that I can practice both feet while doing my skills. I'm also gonna challenge myself to use harder skills. So the first one is gonna be a 360 turn, so then come through, sole roll, take away, stop at my foot, leave the ball there. Same thing in the other direction. So I'm out, 360 turn, sole roll, defeat my player, and leave it here. For this last one, I'm now going to race and time myself around the circuit as quickly as possible. Although I am going to challenge myself to do six different moves on each of the obstacles. Ready, go. Last one. Time. This is the skill circuit for fakes and moves, combining the three sessions from before. First part, step over, beat my man. Drive out, step over, beat my defender. Go to my second ball. This time I'm going to step the other direction and go the other way. Step, take. Step, take with the outside of my foot, leave the ball. So my third and final one in here, I'm going double step over. One, two, in. One, two, leaving the ball. To the second part of the drill. All the way back to the start. Three 360 turns, so in. 360, 360, 360 and finish. And then the last part, dribble it by defender, sole roll to cut inside and finish in the goal. Here's my attempt. My first drill, I'm gonna be using step overs. Second part of the drill, 360 turns. Last, to, last part, sole roll to finish. Here we go. Leaving the ball, getting the other ball. Forming those step overs. Leaving the ball. I'm going to go double step overs now. Back to the second part of the circuit. 360 turns. Finishing the goal on the last part, sole roll, cut inside, and finish. That was a brilliant session, and I hope you learned something new. Uh, I just wanted to end uh, saying that learning new moves and fakes is uh, really important, and uh, practicing as a young player is. It's all you can do and as, you, as long as you have a little bit of space, like I said, uh, there's always a possibility to train. Um, but it's also about finding the confidence and being brave enough to use your moves and fakes that you've learned. So hopefully uh, practicing outside will uh, give you the confidence you need to be able to, to do the moves and fakes in a game. And uh, maybe help your team score a goal, for example. Um, I really look forward to seeing your videos and great job guys and I'll see you next time. Stay home and stay safe. Bye bye.